Hey, it's Jim Fisher, a.k.a. The Beat, with this week's Community News and Columbus Parent. We're down at the Ohio Village at the Ohio History Connection. And joining me is Don Anderson. Don's a member of the uh, Ohio Village Muffins baseball team. And uh, he's going to tell us a little bit about what the muffins do and uh, uh, about the, what they, uh, an event they've got coming up later on this summer. Don, how are you? I'm doing fine, sir. Thank you for being with us today. Um, so the muffins are, are sort of a traditional baseball team. Tell us a little bit about the, the, the history of the group and, and what you guys do. Yes, the Muffins started here in Ohio Village back in 1981. Okay. They, they wanted to show what uh, life was like, uh, leisure life, in the 1860s. So we're portraying uh, vintage baseball as it was vintage played baseball is in the, the word, 1860s. Yes. Okay. Uh, Back in the 1860s, there were social clubs, and on these social clubs, they would often have recreation like baseball. And if they had enough players, they could subdivide their team up into three groups. The first nine, which was the best players. The second nine, which was the second best players. And everybody else were called muffins. Oh. And that's where the term muff came from. Okay. Because you, you they often made some poor plays in the field and they, they muffed the ball. Uh, how is the game different? in the 1860s versus the game that people are familiar with today? The major differences in the game that uh, people will notice is that uh, a ball caught on one bounce is an out. Okay. Okay, right. the that... uh, first bounce of the ball determines whether it's fair or foul. Okay. Not like the modern day where the lines, it has to be inside the third baseline. Okay, very good. Uh, there are no called balls and strikes by the umpire. The, okay. The umpire there is just to uh, handle any disputes should they come up, but okay. uh, in the uh, players are supposed to just walk off if they're out and call their so own. So gentlemen's shots. rules. Yes, very, oh. very much so. Excellent, very good. Um, game play. I mean, is if I'm watching a game, does it look it pretty much like baseball? It looks pretty much like modern baseball. Okay. Yeah. Bases are 90 feet. The pitcher is a little closer. He's okay. 45 feet away. And uh, he'll pitch underhand, okay. not overhand like the modern day uh -huh. baseball. Okay, very good. And, and uh, uniform and gear obviously yeah. is, is going to look different to folks too. Yeah, bats are very similar. The only restriction on bats were that they not be more than two and a half inches in diameter, okay. but they could be uh, long. I, I use one that's about 37 and three quarter inches long. Gotcha, okay. And uh, also, you will, the one thing you might notice is that the players don't have any gloves on their hands. So Aha, uh -huh. okay. play with bare hands. All right, so you're playing with a softer ball? Uh, no, the ball's <laughs> no? Not, okay. not that much softer. <laughs> all right, right. Okay. very good. Um, uh, the, the team plays pretty much all summer long? Yes, we begin in April and okay. wind up in October. All right, but in uh, the end of August, you've got sort of a feature event yes, that takes place. Yes, we, we have the Ohio Cup, and there will be I believe 31 teams here this year okay. from, from many states. All right. Other vintage teams that... Uh, All other say, vintage teams. Okay. Most of which can directly link their startup to the Muffins in one way or another. Terrific. Okay, very good. Okay, so they... They want me to take a few swings. I'm not sure how well this is going to go, but let's see so what I happens. I have to go all the way out there. <laughs> I haven't even played softball in about 10 years. Oh, look at that. Not trying to hurt anybody. <laughs> that was well struck. That's a gentleman's game. Now you get a chance to see him catch it on the first bounce. On the first bounce, okay. You're out, but if there's a runner on, they didn't have to go back and tag up. Okay. Very well. Yeah. Not too shabby. That's I, then I need a designated runner. Do we have those? So the Muffins will host the Ohio Cup here at the Ohio Village, August 30th and 31st. Uh, all the details available on the website, ohiohistory.org. And you also want to check out the FAM5 at columbusparent.com.
<laughs> He's not even swinging very hard. Well, that's 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 what BP's for, right? Yeah, let's go with that. <laughs> Make Kurt work out there. Yeah. I did that one in purpose. <laughs> <laughs>